Hey my babes, I'm pretty sure you guys have been wondering where I've been. But let me start off by saying I'm so sorry about the lighting. Right now, there is no good lighting. I've turned on here. every light in this room. So I do apologize about the lighting. I don't know if it's going to rain. I don't know if it's just because it's getting cold outside. I'm not sure. So sorry about that. But I'm pretty sure you guys are wondering where have I been. I have so many videos to upload for you all. But I've been working and Thanksgiving is over now. I done been to, oh my God, Thanksgiving was so good for me. Like, I was in another town with my girlfriend and her family. And then we went by my grandmother's house and my aunt. And then we went by my other aunts and everybody's house in that one town. Like, oh my God. And then the whole school break of Thanksgiving, my two wonderful boys. As you can tell from the title, I have a massive haul to show you all. Can we start by saying what just came in my mail made me so happy. I mean, so, so happy. I want to thank Tom the Infamous here on YouTube for introducing me to this lovely piece of heaven. Like, <sighs> I'm super I have excited. Sephora. I have my October Ipsy. No, my November Ipsy. I've been to Ross. I've been to the dollar stores. I've ordered off of this uh, website called Wish. I've ordered off of Amazon. So you guys sit back Please and just. let's get ready to dig into all this. I'm sorry there won't be any swatches or um, I won't be doing many swatches or detail review in this video just because it's a whole lot of stuff. But if you but, would like to um, see a swatch or a in-depth review on any of this, just comment down below and I will make sure to get that video over to you. Now, there is a, uh, a swatch video that I plan on doing here. It's on some old stuff, but I just got it to my collection, so therefore, I want to get right show it off because I've been dying to use this stuff for like the last month or so. And if you guys do not know anything about Wish.com, I will link it down below, but a lot of the things, no matter if you order one thing or 50 things, they all still come in its own shipping time. And so if you all would like to see all of this real goodness, just stick around. If you don't like this video or if you don't want to see the things that I got, go ahead and click the X, but, uh, the X button. I do have other videos that you would more than likely enjoy. Um, but yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And let's get right into it. So let's go ahead and start with my Ipsy subscription. It always comes in that pink, cute enveloping I absolutely love this color like I get so excited when I see this in the mail so this month is beauty blast and it has crispy on it and I know she's a YouTube girl but I don't know her that well I think I've seen maybe a couple of her videos but I, I remember crispy I watch a lot love of her the videos. bag OMG love the bag it is so adorable so, this month, I'm not too, too excited, but then again, I am. So, let's just get right into it, and I'll show you the things that I am excited about. So, so this, this one is Amir Couture, and it's Hello Gorgeous Travel With Me Makeup Paper. It's the Travel Blush, and the color is Sicily. And I'm not too fond about this, but, I mean, 
I've never heard of it, but I will give it a try. And it's just a little cardboard. Let's see if I can open it. So it comes like that. Oh, and it's falling out. Okay. So it's multiple papers, and I'm a. Sh so it's I'm multiple assuming. papers, and comes like this. It's a couple of them, and it has the Snapchat, the Instagram, and the hashtag. On the so back. if you all would like to go follow them, there's the information, and I will make sure to put it down below as well. But that's how it comes. I don't know if I'm gonna actually use it. I mean, I guess I could try it. But I don't, I don't know if I'm going to actually use it. And I don't know much about it. I don't know. So it says to tap or rub paper up, up apples of the cheek for more color payoff. Repeat motions with more pressure. One sheet is good for both cheeks. So I'll give it a try. I'm just not too excited about it. So yeah, that's that. And then the next thing we got is the Cool Wave Stronghold Spray. Which, nine times out of ten, I'm not going to use this. I may put it in my giveaway pile or pass it on to my niece. I'm not a big fan of hairspray that much. I really don't use that much hairspray. Even in my weaves, I don't use that much. But this one is a .5 ounce. So, I mean, if you all heard anything about this, please comment your uh your opinion down below and let me know what you think of it and then the next we got the Stratique mini matte lip crayon and it's in Florence thick and I think I'm saying that right and I like the color it's a nude color Which would be good for everyday wear. I hope this camera is picking it up, you guys. I'm so sorry. But it feels so dark in here. So it's the last the thing I got is Navy Gel Eyeliner. But mine got smudged off. So if you all know what that is, comment down below. But it got smudged off. And it's in the color Navy. I'm not sure what that second B word is. But that's that. And my Ipsy subscription. And I know I'm behind, but I can't wait for December to get here. Hopefully, it's a lot of goodies in that one. So, moving on. Something that I got for Thanksgiving. Yes, you guys, I said that I was going to make my first vlog of my first time going into a Sephora or a Mac or a Ulta. But, I surprisingly went to the Sephora in another town where my girlfriend lives and... It just so happened to be Black Friday's uh, starting sale um, on Thanksgiving, and we were right there by the mall. So I was like, hmm, babe, you want to go into your mall? Like, I just wanted to see what the Sephora looked like. I didn't really want to shop because I I'm knew so it was going to be hectic. Ice cream and happy birthday. Like, I thought somebody walked through my house. I didn't really um, want to shop anyways. because I knew it was going to be super freaking busy. So I just really wanted to go in there and see it and see what all goodies they had. And she made me promise that I only got two things out of there, which I really wasn't planning on getting anything. But once I got in there and fell into heaven of makeup, oh my God. I see how everybody spends their paychecks at Sephora. Like, mm, gosh. So, babe got me two things from Sephora and I didn't vlog it I left my phone in a car because I wasn't planning on getting anything but I do plan on going back because for my birthday you get a free gift and I'm gonna go with no makeup on so my hopefully the sales lady that helped me Destiny could help me out on my birthday because Destiny was the bomb like she was so nice and she matched me with everything she told me the good stuff she told me what wasn't her favorite and stuff like that so destiny was the bomb so the first thing i got was the makeup forever professional pairs palette this is the packaging it came with a book oh and it's the artist shadow 2 and i just love it like 
I want to hang this up. On I the wanted wall. to get the know. orange pathogen one, but they didn't have it at the time. So I went with this one, and Destiny told me it was good. Comes with a nice size mirror, and here's the colors, which I thought was good for my first time buying a high end palette. I think these are some good, pretty colors, and she told me they're very pigmented. And I see a lot of guys. I mean, a lot of girls using this here on YouTube, so I don't think I could go wrong. And it has a lot of colors that I absolutely like, like this dark forest green, that blue, that pink, like the purple. It has a lot of beautiful colors. So nine colors to start off with for Makeup, makeup Forever. Um, yeah, I think this is a good one. Babe didn't. She didn't give me no help. She just swears I had every single color somewhere in my collection. So this is it. And it has a hard back. It's very heavy. So I think I'm going to like it. That Kat Von D Locket Foundation. And I'm pretty sure all y'all seen this before. But I'm in the number Deep 74. And it's a tad bit too light for me right now. But... With the contouring and highlight and all that, it's all going to even out. So, yes, I had to get it. And I got this one in the, how many ounces is this one? One for an ounce. So, and I was going to just take a sample and try it first, but I didn't want to wait. I just wanted to take it. But I will be going back for the HD foundation uh, on my birthday. All this stuff is mixed up and now they, that I'm about to show you guys. All of it is mixed up, so if I could remember exactly where I got it from, I will mention it. But as of right now, all of it is mixed up. So for one, I got I the Bad Hair Day beanie, which you all know I love my wrap. And it's only because I only wear my wrap a lot because of where I work at. So it keeps me from having to wear a hat all day. And, yeah, sure, I could wear my beanies and stuff to work, but then I don't want to get my beanies dirty. So, I had to, I like to wear my wrap. But, me getting this black beanie and it saying bad hair day, oh my god, I could wear this to work at all times. Like, yes, I could wear it to work all the time except for my, instead of my wrap. So, this one here was $2 from Wish, and I loved it. Behind it. That's a rose gold one, and I don't know if it's going to be cute, but I wanted to try it, and from time to time wear it. I'm pretty sure it's going to irritate me because, like I said, I can't stand anything in my nose, so it's just something to try, and this one was a dollar, so, and I bought a silver one somewhere around here, too, that I will be showing you guys in a minute, and then I wish these were four bucks for a ten, I believe. Whew! These are the lip stickers, and it's by Sexy Fashionable, and it's safe and non-toxic. So, this is from some Korean or Chinese um, company, but I just absolutely adore them and cannot wait to try these. Look at this one. I'm pretty sure that is just going to be so juicy looking. And this is just something to have fun with when I'm doing my tutorials or something. Like, why oh, I got two pink dots, polka dots. They are pink. I love this one. This is another favorite. And then the last one looks like that. And, then the and they were only four dollars. So I have shade seventy-five. I don't know if these have a name on them. No. So I got the number seventy-five. Looks like that. And I have the number sixty. Looks like that. And I've never bought these, like, not one time when I've seen them. And I've seen a lot of hype about them, but I never bought them. Number 55 looks like that. And I just was like, uh, no, I'm not into it. But when I've seen them for a dollar nineteen, this is well okay, as I got it. four of the Maybelline Color Tattoo. Pure pigments. Yes, I had to get them. So I got... Uh, Pink Rebel. Look like that. I'm so sure this camera is washing my stuff out. Um, this one is Breaking Bronze. I can't wait to use these in tutorials. This is Downtown Brown. Sorry. 
and then I got Never Fade Jade. So those are the four I got, and that was from the Nothing Over Dollar Nineteen store. I wanted to take the whole basket, but I knew I wouldn't. I knew I wasn't gonna be right. So I got eight of the LA Colors High Shine Shea Butter Lip Glosses. I got eight of them, and I'm not, as I said, I'm not gonna do swatches. But this one is hyper, and it's a pretty baby doll pink. Then I got dynamic, no, dynamite, which is a fiery red. Then I got baby cakes, which reminds me of my cousin. We call each other baby cakes all the time, and it's just a soft little pink. And this one is flaunt, which is a darker pink. Then I got the baby doll pink, and it's just a pretty little baby doll pink. Then we have playful, the glittery pink, and mingle. Is a real pretty glittery purplish pink. Then I have lavish, which is a darker purplish pink, uh, a darker purple, glittery purple. And then we have doll face, which is a pretty nude brown color, which I think I'm gonna love. So that's the eight. And if you guys would like to see a lip swatch or swatches of these, just let me know. I will comment. Uh, just comment down below, and I will as well as those right up. So these are new that I found in my store and I, I watch a lot of YouTube and I haven't heard anyone speak on this so I have five new LA color LA color <laughs> LA color color uh, color gel extreme shine gel like polish and I got five of them I haven't heard anybody talk about these, but I'm dying to try them because they're gel-like. So I know they'll last a lot longer if if they hold gel-like. Because I know the ones that are not gel-like, that are regular LA colors, they don't hold as well. But I still love the colors. And I have a whole lot. That's what I'm looking at. Sorry. So I got five of them. And if you guys would like... A more in-depth video of this as well just let me know these were only two dollars as well so I got vanilla latte which is a soft nudie brown color and I love the name vanilla latte I love that then I have zinc which is a beautiful ocean blue color one of my favorite colors then I go with flirt which then is a darker have nudie pink, which is a beautiful pink as well and then for the very last one is meant to be which is a bluish green color. Almost like a tur a light turquoise color. So also from yeah. Wish, I got this brush egg, which I could clean my brushes with. And it's not a whole hand mitten, but it you could slide in two fingers and it's purple. It was a dollar and it's very rubbery. So I got this to help clean my brushes because half of the time I'm using my hand and my hands get all pruny. So yeah. I went for this one, and of course I had to get purple. The pink one didn't look so pink, so yeah, got that. So now I had to bring the whole basket to me because I was running a little low. So then I got this opal brush, which is not a real opal brush. I got it off a of Wish, so it's one of the knockoff brushes, and I wanted to try it in a cheaper form before I, I go to the MAC collection and get theirs. I just wanted to see what's the idea of it. I know it's not going to feel the same. I know it's not going to look the same. I know it's not going to be the same size and et cetera, et cetera. But these were $2. So I just wanted to get it just to see what I was potentially looking at. Like it's a good size. I thought it was going to be a big one for the foundation, like the whole face. But this one is more like for the concealer. I mean, I guess you could do foundation. It's just going to take you a lot longer to smooth and buff that out. But this one to me looks like it'll be for a concealer. And it's not as durable. But I mean, it was $2. So it comes like that. And I mean, it. I'm pretty sure we'll see when I try to apply my makeup. So this, I think this will be a good one for a concealer. So if you guys, I'm pretty sure you'll see it in a tutorial, but if you guys would like to see me use it in a tutorial, just let me know. So, the next thing, okay, so I got these 
I think they're 10 piece finger jewelry sets. You guys know how I am about my fake jewelry. I'd rather keep fake jewelry than to keep all the real jewelry and lose it. So, got 10 a piece. You guys will most likely be seeing these being worn. I love them. I've worn them a couple of times. I just have to make sure to put them back so that I can show you all. But these both were a dollar a piece. And then I got this cute little necklace. Um, if you guys follow me on Snapchat and Instagram, you see me wear one of these necklaces. So I went to the already. Dollar Tree. And I like wearing nails, but like I said, I work so much that I really can't just wear, wear nails. So I like to get these little press-on nails for when I'm just doing nothing. So, got these, which are the white tip with the silver lining. And then I got the blue polka dots. And then this one is like a floor, uh, leaves or something on it, but it's black and white, so I loved it. And then these, I really did like the pink ones. And then here's the other pink ones. I said I was collecting these baby lips, lip glosses. So I'm almost done collecting them. I think I accidentally bought this one twice, which is tickled pink. So I think I'm at a uh, 10 and not 12. Well, I'm actually at 11, but got two of the same. And then I got very chic. And I just like to collect these, and they're, they are good. I've worn them a couple of times. Oh, no, I got bear chic twice. I may have gotten both of them twice now that I look. So maybe I'm not as close as I thought. But I got that, and then I got the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara, the clear transparent for your eyebrows. I like the F one that I used, but I wanted to try the Maybelline one. And then I hear everybody talking about this one, and I got the other one. So I wanted to try this one I got the Maybelline uh, super stay better skinny concealer and I got mine in medium deep and I have the fit me concealer stick so yeah can't you tell Maybelline is one of my favorites like one of my favorites so then off Amazon I was so impressed with the shiny uh, collection of the startup kit makeup kit that I got from them uh, from her a long time ago like at the beginning of this year so when I seen this palette eyeshadow palette I wanted to go ahead and try it so I got it off of Amazon and I believe it was four bucks I can't remember but it's um, 40 eyeshadow colors the box comes like this which I thought was so cute um, but I got 40 colors and I can't wait to start playing Holy crap, a couple of them just fell out. Her eyeshadows. A couple, of, are couple good. of them just fell out, like three of them. So, like I was saying, I don't want to tilt it no more because I don't know how many more are going to fall out. Um, but it was like four bucks, so I'm not mad. I'm pretty sure the color pigment has nothing to do with them falling out. And all I have to do is put a little glue on it and it'll stay. 40 colors. I'm pretty sure I will use every single color in here to make a look in so many different ways. So I'm excited about that one. Another thing that I got off Amazon for a dollar is these Asian lashes. And I don't even know what they're called. I don't know what they're called, but they I thought they were cute. It's 10 pair of lashes. They look like this. And I thought about putting them in my kit for when I do other people's makeup. I'm not freelancing yet, but I have done a couple of things. So, I just did um, one of my good friends' makeup for her graduation. And her graduation pictures came out so nice. And, oh, you guys, she is a comedian here on YouTube. So, I will have her information linked down below. My girl, Mo. She is completely hilarious, so please check her out and go like, comment, and subscribe to her channel. She also has a Facebook that I will have linked down below as well, but check her out on YouTube. She is really funny. Like, I keep telling her to keep posting all her videos to YouTube, 
and sometimes she does sometimes she don't but a lot of her stuff is on Facebook oh and I just found another nail so here's another set it's just clear with the book Ross but yeah, moving along I went to Ross and I went I can't even remember what I went to Ross for. I think I was just bored when I got off of work. So I went to Ross and I found these little ceramic trays, which are so freaking cute. Like this one has an S on it for my last name because it didn't have an A. So this is my last name for the S. And then this one here is for my lovely girlfriend. Like I think these are so cute. And not only my girlfriend, but my son, both of my sons actually, and my girlfriend is all K. Well, Casanova is not with a K. My mom wouldn't let me name him with a K because she said it wouldn't be Casanova if I named him with a K. So I've always thought of him, his name being spelled with a K. But we do call him Cash Money with a K. So Keetra and Cass and Kayla. That's for them. And then, of course, Stewart's. They didn't have an S because, I mean, they didn't have a H because of her last name. But we're going to make these work. And if I find any more, trust and believe, I'm going to get them. Oh, and these were $3.49. So I'm going to either put my little jewelry pieces on it or put some cosmetic stuff on it here on my vanity. So... Anyways, next thing, I got this Good Grip. It says Medicine Cabinet Divided Organizer. But, of course, I'm going to use it for anything of my tools. So, yeah. That's what And that's then, of for. course, I got me another drawer organizer to stack under the one I already got. And this one was $11.99. So, it's a three drawer, long drawer. And I'm going to just put it on top of the other one so you guys I've never heard anyone speak of this so I had to get it because I can't wait to try it out but if you guys do know anything about it let me know comment down below let me know your thoughts on it it's the Revlon color stay not just nudes palette I found it in Walmart and it has some pretty nudes in it <clears throat> Comes with a little brush and it comes with all these nudes. Two, four, six, six. Comes with 10 shadows, which I think are going to be adorable. And it's just called Passionate Nudes. I love it. I can't wait to try it out. And the, the packaging is real slim. Off of Amazon, like. after doing so much research, oh my God, so much research, I finally got me a sleek palette. And this is the I just palette. wanted a sleek palette, period. And I don't have friends in the UK or anything like that. So I had to do my own research, make sure it was real because I had to get it. And of course, big mirror and these gorgeous colors. And I can't wait to try it out. I'm pretty sure all you ladies have seen that, but the colors are amazing. Amazing. So, yes, my very first. Sleek palette. Last but never be least. You guys, this is what I just got in my mail for my birthday. Ah! Uh, thank you so much, Time the Infamous, for this baby. No, Time the Infamous did not send this to me, but she introduced me to it. So I have to sit like this. So I got 33 ounces of the makeup brush cleaner. <sighs> Lalumi, Lalumia, Lalumia makeup brush cleaning device, and I got the one in Paris as a birthday gift. And it says it cleans up to 12 makeup brushes at once. It's four color option. I got the glossy pink one. I'm so in love with this one. So, yeah, if you guys want to see me use this for the first time, let me know. Can't wait to use this, and I'm so, so, so happy about that. Okay, sorry guys. I went to my niece's basketball game, and while I was recording the haul video, 
I completely forgot what time it was, so I had to run out and go get my kids and then go to the basketball game, which I totally forgot. But after the Lanumia I got, that was it of the haul. That completed my haul, and that was it. And I will be doing a video on how to set it up. I have to watch a couple of videos on how to work it, but I have to... I'm going to do a video on how to set it up and how does it work for the first time. I want to catch that experience on camera. So if you guys are for that, please link it down. I'm sorry. Comment down below and let me know that you would like to see that video. But yeah, that I want you to like to stick around for the next video because I also have another haul. But I had to give that one its own video because huh, it's a lot of stuff as well again but please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you ladies at my next video